check your PR or requisition status and details this way. We will also give you a tip on how to check if a PO is already created for your PR. Let's do it. So, watch this. Welcome to Vertical Q, your guide to efficient warehousing. Do this instruction when checking for the details and status of your PR. 1. Click the transaction code ME53N and hit enter on your keyboard. 2. Select other purchase requisition. 3. Type the PR number into the purchase requisition field. 4. Take or select purchase requisition. 5. Select other document. 6. Navigate to the release strategy tab. 7. Use the navigation arrows to move between lines and check their status. All lines must complete the workflow and have green checks in their status column before a purchase order will be issued. Please keep the following tips in mind when checking the purchase requisition. Completed stages of the workflow will show a green check in the status column. Pending stages will show a yellow triangle. Depending on the GL used, a requisition can travel through other workflows besides you as the requisitioner, the area manager and project manager, or the head of the department. In the example above, line 10 has been approved by the area manager, project manager, or the head of the department. Here is the bonus tip for you. If a purchase order has already been issued for a purchase requisition, it can be found in the status tab under the purchasing document column. Checking the status and details of your PR is now complete. Thank you, thank you for watching. To show your happiness and support for this channel, you may wish to continue sending super thanks by tapping the super thanks button down there. And please, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button for more warehousing and workplace English lessons. Once again, thank you.